everybody. This is Sherry with CPR Craft Ray Repeat. I put some stamps down here for you all to look at. These are stamps by Judith. And I absolutely love them. They are so cute. And um, I would hope to have been able to do a haul video for you of them. But that's not going to happen. <coughs> Because I'm on my way to the emergency room. Um, my oxygen level is really, really low. And um, Mariah is in a hospital in Gainesville. I'm not sure where they, where I will exactly go yet. But um, I just wanted everyone to know that they can call. Or they can not call. <laughs> They can get a hold of Lisa through Charlisa's Crafty Corner, and I'll put a link in the description box for you down down here, and um, and that way you can you know find out what's going on. Um, I've been fighting this for oh golly for a long time, and I'm just so tired. I don't have any strength left. And I wish things were different, but I just, you know, I can't take another day of it. And I went, um, I went to Shands of UF in Gainesville, and it, um, it was absolutely awful. I was, um, on, I was waiting for nearly eight hours, a little way between seven and a half and eight hours. And uh, they ended up just saying me, you know, I, I waited and I waited and I waited and, and, um, and I felt okay when I got there because I didn't have a fever or anything. And, uh, but by the time, you know, by the time it was, 7.30, I think it was. By the time 7.30 rolled around, I had this horrible, horrible fever, and I just felt awful. And so I had all I could take. I could not take other thing. And so Lisa will keep you all updated. And... And my daughter, Danae, will keep my family updated up north. And, um, and I just want everybody to know that I love them. I appreciate their kindness and their prayers. And, and to please just uh, continue to pray for us. Jesse's 100% better. He's... Um, you know, he's doing great. He's, you know, not running a fever. He's, you know, I mean, he's fine. He is essentially absolutely fine. And I just hope that Mariah and I can catch up and, uh, you know, and get that way really soon. And because I am just... I just can't take any more, guys. I absolutely cannot take any more. And, um, so that's it. That's about all I can think of that I needed to tell you and where you needed to go. And so if you have any questions or whatever, you can direct them to Lisa and she will let you know what's going on in my life and you know she'll tell you and uh, I'm sure it will come out that my life is pretty boring <laughs> but um, so that's about it and I, mean, I had so many plans to do you know for the past two weeks and you know, let's just say I couldn't do any of them so I'm sorry. Oh, for Pete's sakes, guys. I'm sorry. 
I am, I don't know if it's from my sleep apnea, I don't know what's causing this, but I just zone out and I'm just, I just want to be better. And I am so tired. And I was trying to take my oxygen last, last night and, and I just had to keep trying and trying and trying and trying because I would go and and then uh, if you don't get the number when it pops up, it continues to roll on up and on up and on up or on down or on down. I don't even remember. But so I need the number, the first number that shows to know what my oxygen level is. And I'm just like, I can't believe this. And so I must have had to take it at least, I don't know, at least a dozen times. And, um, but it's just, it's just really getting to me. And, uh, but I won't stay on here any longer because, one, it hurts to talk, and two, I just can't, can't bear to, to continue. <laughs> and, uh, please keep Mariah and I in your prayers, and, you know, please just bathe Mariah in your prayers because she's in ICU at Shands of UF and she really, really needs your prayers. And uh, I just want her better. And she just, she looks so pitiful and she just said, I want, I want to feel better. I want to come home. And I was just and I was trying so hard not to cry and, you know, and I told her, I said, you're going to be okay, baby. You know, you're going to be okay. I said, you know, us wolf women, you know, we're tough. I said, you're, you're tough, Mariah. I said, you fight this with everything you got. And you, you give it, give all you got and you'll get better. And um, I just want her better. And, um, yesterday they weren't sure if they were going to have to put, um, put her, or if they were going to have to intubate her, and, you know, I just, I just want her better. And, um, frankly, I'm tired of being sick, and so, that's it, guys. Pray she's strong. Pray she has the strength to fight. She looks so weak, so absolutely weak. That's it. All right, guys. I love you. And if you, like I said, if you have any questions, um, contact Lisa through her channel. And I'll talk to you as soon as I can. As soon as I'm feeling better and all this is, you know... <laughs> Oh, this is done. Alright. Love you guys. <laughs>